Well, welcome back, everyone. You know, Shrek the Musical is coming to the Lima Civic Center, and that's going to be on October the 13th. And we have one of the actors joining us today. His name is Timmy Lewis. So welcome, Timmy. Hey there. How's it going? Thanks I, for having me. I am so happy that you guys are coming to Lima because this is such a brilliant musical. It's funny. It's got great music. And tell us a little bit about what character you're playing. Absolutely. Well, I am lucky enough, fortunate enough to get to play Lord Farquaad. Um, he is your classic, classic caricature uh, villain. Um, and he, I, I truly, I say, I say I'm lucky because um, I think he's he's written so so well. So much of uh, what we know from the movie still exists. But then um, David Lindsay Bear and Janine Tesori have also taken the character and just reworked him a bit in a way that is just such a such a treat to be able to bring to audiences all over the country because I think that, you know, people can see a little bit of their selves in him, even though he is the villain. But of course, at the end of the day, he is still human, um, um, even though it is sort of a fairy tale story. Um, but it's just, yeah, it's it's a it's a hoot yeah. and a half um, just to be able to to be that ridiculous while still, you know, trying to find the truth in it and, you know, do all those fun and, and beautiful, you know, artistic things that we get to do on stage in this lovely, lovely production. Yeah, and I will say that for those that are familiar with the with the show itself, the movie, it really falls in line with that movie. There's some extra things here and there, but you, you'll notice some of the, a lot of similarities from the movie to the show, to the musical itself. Um, the characters are fun, you know, they're very related your character is hilarious. Um, your Lord Farquaad kind of steals the show for me, I think, because he is just one of those characters that you just keep talking about by the end of the show because he is so funny. Now, what what kind of stuff do you, does it take you to get into that character? Because I'm telling you, he steals the show. I'm sure you, I can't wait to see you in the show. Well, thank you. Appreciate that. Um, I'm excited for you to see it. Um, <laughs> I, you know, it doesn't, honestly, it doesn't take very much because I think it's all right there on the page and, and, and in the music, it's there. It's already so well crafted in that regard. You kind of, in a way, almost just have to read it the way it is. And I think the character just kind of comes to life. Um, obviously, we, you know, rehearsed it and tried different things and found it. But in terms of, you know, getting into it, I think because it is just so crafted so beautifully by such um, brilliant creators. Um, it, it really, it's not that hard. <laughs> it's not that hard. I'm, I'm lucky, I, I guess I just, you know, I think this is just one of those shows that there are definitely moments that are tough to find. Um, certain things rhythmically that you have to work out. Uh, also just like finding tone and finding like just general intention and direction of where you want to, how you want to shape the character and like everything like that. But in terms of you know, once that's done, getting there and, you know, getting into it is just... It's easy. Yeah. No, I will say that there's uh, this show is one of those shows that you can watch over and over and over again because you may miss something the first time you watch it because there are so many funny lines and comedic geniuses that are all written throughout the entire show. And it's, it's easy to miss something because you're too busy laughing. And it's, it's just <laughs> one of those, it really is. And so it's one of, those, one of those shows that you can watch over and over again. I've seen it a couple times and I can't wait to see it again. You guys are going to be at the Lima Civic Center on October the 13th. That's a Sunday and it's going to be 6 p.m. I will say tickets are selling fast so you want to get out and get those tickets as soon as you can because like I said, tickets are selling fast. It's a brilliant show. Timmy, I cannot wait for you to see you on stage in makeup I'm just wowing the audience. You're going to be great. So I want to say thank you so much for coming on today. I appreciate it. Yeah, of course. Thanks for having me. And we hope to see you and everybody at the Civic Center. All right. Well, don't go away because we have more than we return.